infinito. What is going on everybody? Welcome, welcome to the last part of this week WWE Time News and Rumors Roundup. First and foremost, uh, thank you so much for supporting my WWE 2K17 Everything That We Know So Far video that I posted this morning. And if you haven't watched it, go check it out. But anyways guys, uh, like every weekend, uh, today we are talking about the WWE Monday Night Raw preview. Monday Night Raw airing on July 4th. By the way, if you are in the States, of course, uh, happy 4th of July. And if you're gonna drink drink it in man drink it in make sure that you do not drink and dry but anyways in a very quick fashion let's get right to the news and into the preview late saturday night we had some breaking news that apparently kurt angle was gonna be returning to monday night raw on july 4th this rumor was reported by dwn but it was soon basically taken down i know that the website got suspended for a couple of hours i don't know what that had to do with anything but i just know that when i started to read it from then that directly the website was suspended it is back on already i don't know what that was all about but i could tell you this the rumors were pretty much debunked today because of the new rumors by pw insider now as we know during the past couple of weeks we have gotten a lot of smackdown gm returning to raw just to basically promote the draft and this is where basically the kurt angle report and breaking news kind of came in because kurt angle was once a general manager of smackdown fun times by the way when he was in the wheelchair oh my god those were amazing and feuding with the big show but anyways pw insider is reporting that, that the returning former general manager book for monday night raw is none other than former gn vicky guerrero now of course this is not confirmed but this is the latest when it comes to, to that preview that has been teased on wwe.com as you guys can see will a former smackdown general manager join in in monday's festivities and we're gonna have a rematch from smackdown a champion versus champion the Miz versus Dean Ambrose when they clash on Monday Night Raw. Could The Miz score a leading role in this summer's blockbuster? Moving on to the second point of the preview, will John Cena get payback against the club? I don't know why this is being teased because after all, John Cena did got payback on Monday Night Raw. He basically got cheated out of his victory by the club, but he also made AJ Styles lose for the opportunity to compete at Battleground for the World Heavyweight Championship my bad let me clarify the wwe championship so that was a payback from the same winner but nonetheless john cena does still need payback because he did lose his first match against aj styles my bet is that aj Styles versus john cena will be announced on monday night raw for either the draft as it was rumored earlier in the week or also for battleground with some type of speculation as it was also reported and then we have two more matches that are announced for the show and that is rusev versus titus o'neill for the u.s title and yes i know we're getting it again at least it's not in a pay-per-view right and the last preview that i got for you guys is that wwe.com can confirm that raw's 4th of july celebration will include a tag team action on a global scale when team usa battles a team world in a 16-man elimination tag team match which american superstars will clash with a squad of international competitors that is the only preview but no participant have been announced for either team so far and that is pretty much it guys i mean it has been a pretty slow weekend when it comes to news besides everything that i just discussed the top story is basically that at real bobby heenan twitter account is actually fake and it was removed from twitter today basically after being verified and everything and also on a pretty cool news uh, cody Rowe will be part of the season of five of arrow i wonder what character what villain he's gonna play so that should be interesting but yeah guys uh, that's about it Oh, and we do got another good news, and that is that Emma tried to save Zack Ryder from a shark that was eating him. But yeah, I hope you guys get the point that there is not much news to discuss right now. Let's just get Monday Night Raw rolling. Thank you guys for watching. Drop a like if you guys found this informative. Let me know if you guys are gonna be watching Raw. And we are on the road to 2,000 subscribers. Macho Tiao, dig it. Drink it in, man. Drink it in.